up everybody, Rez back here again, and today I'm going to introduce you guys to my new truck, the F350 with the 7.3 Power Stroke, you know, because we'd rather be stroking than Cummins around here, <laughs> but, uh, so what we're going to do now, I just got the truck from a good friend of mine, and we're going to do some maintenance, drove it all the way from Chicago, we got all this fuel, or fuel, fuel, we got all this oil, we're going to do an oil change and a fuel filter replacement along with the oil filter. So we got that Motorcraft OEM straight from Ford, and we're gonna go ahead and knock this out so that way we, the truck can continue to last a bajillion more miles so I can tow the drift car. Hey, on these diesels, all right, the diesel, not only, the diesel fuel itself lubricates the engine, right? So it is important on these vehicles to change the, uh, the fuel filter as often as possible. A lot of people will do the fuel filter every time they change the engine oil on the truck. That's what I recommend as well. And then running a good additive in the fuel tank, that's gonna uh, help save your motor and, and uh, basically clean it out. Because when you put new oil in it, the important thing is the additives, right? They have additive packages. And basically think of the additives as detergents. They go in your motor and as your pistons are going up and down, that oil is cleaning your engine, right? Um, so that's why it's important to change it, you know, at a recommended interval, 3,000, 5,000, however many miles you want to do it, because the oil will still be fine, but the additive package, it's no longer going to be cleaning the motor. So, yep, so we're going to go ahead and do all that today, make sure that we take care of the truck so it can take care of us in the future. Right now <clears throat> is we took a hose to the fuel filter. There's like this little valve right back there. <clears throat> we didn't have the hose there, but we put a hose there, so that way we, we got to turn that valve and what it does is that it uh, lets all the fuel that's in there, all the diesel that's in there, it lets it out and kind of relieves that pressure that the, that the fuel filter housing has so that in order to be able to take it off. So that's what we're doing first. We got a hose in there. We put a water bottle right there because we didn't have a hose long enough that can go all the way to the bottom. So that's what we're using. We had to run to the store to get a longer hose because the one that we had was not long enough. So this is about four feet long, uh, should work good. Again, we're attaching it to the valve on the fuel filter, which is like right over, right there somewhere. Yeah, right there. And that way we can drain the fuel that's in there to release that pressure. So let's get to it. We just got the fuel filter open. Here you go. There it is. You can see it. it's not, honestly, it's not that old. It looks like it's probably been changed. Uh, it is a little dirty. The, the inside filter is dirty. The screen isn't too bad yet. Um, so we put this hose on here. We were able to turn the lever to release the pressure, drain it down yep, uh, to the bottom. Now what we're going to do is we're going to switch this filter out and switch out the O-ring on here, which the O-ring, honestly, it looks really good still. So um, we'll just put the new one on there just to be safe. But yeah, we're just going to toss this thing and put the new OEM fuel filter on there. Yep, Motorcraft. Bye -bye. So there's two O-rings that you gotta change, not only the one that's on the top, but there's one that goes on the fuel filter itself right here, as you can see. And I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you the actual diagram that the filter came with. Kinda tells you exactly where everything needs to go. It's pretty simple instructions. And then the second one, like he said, the filter, that O-ring's not that bad, but I might as well just put the new one in there because we have it. And it goes, it's going to be shaped kind of like a triangle from what we saw in like another video. And the triangle part goes facing up. Not the best design. Yeah. It's late, late 90s <laughs> power stroke technology right here. <laughs> Might even be better to just throw, leave the old one in there. Yeah, I really don't like this one. Just getting it, getting it to lay right. All it takes is you put it on there wrong, and it'll leak. You don't want to feel leak in here. We'll try this. I'll flatten it down. I think this will flatten itself. Maybe. Did it? I mean, yeah, it'll work. 
it looks like it's in place. Yeah, Which one looks cool. better, though? I like that one, but I don't know how old that one is. All right. All right, so now that we got the filter put in, thanks to Sean, uh, what we're doing now is we're like priming the system. What you want to do is you want to put the key in the ignition and turn it. I'll go ahead and show you guys. Now you go ahead and you'll put the key in. Then you'll go ahead and turn it and then just let it sit for 30 seconds and do that about four or five times. And then you can actually hear the flules in here kind of going off. Maybe you can't because this is like the third time already, but we heard it the first few times. You just want to do that like three or four times, and that's pretty much that's pretty much it. Once you get that done, then you're pretty much all taken care of with that uh, fuel, fuel filter. God dang it. Pretty much done with the fuel filter, and now we're going to go right into the oil so we can get that done. It uses like a bajillion quarts of oil. You need like a, a bunch, a bunch of shell. Man. You can get these bad jokers, these bad layers. You can get these these things at Walmart. Wally World. Walmart. They have the best price. I've tried everywhere. Walmart has the best price hands best down. Best price. Better than Amazon. Better than Advanced Auto. This is this is what you want to do. You want to do that Rotella, baby. Yep. That exactly. Rotella. That's why I run in my race car, too. I'll run it in everything. T5 15W40. All right. And then the, the filter is going to be a Motorcraft filter, which is Ford's uh, OEM brand. So you want to use the Motorcraft filter. It is an FL 1995. You can also buy this bad joker at walmart walmart we ain't got time to go to the dang dealer yep walmart baby <laughs> all right so now here's the moment of truth we're gonna get this thing hopefully it starts john is always making fun of me because these trucks are notorious for not wanting to start i got my foot dance ready oh got it no leaks, everything went on pretty smooth. And remember, preventative maintenance is always the best way to prevent your shit from breaking. So keep doing it. Next, oil. Right, so we're here under the, the truck and this is the fuel, the oil pan right here. And it is a 19 millimeter socket. And that is it right there. Um, there's gonna be a buttload of oil coming out of here. So make sure you actually have a, actually you take the cap off your, oil pan jug thing whatever the fuck and then make sure you just drain it in there so we'll get a little video of that here in a little bit are you recording it not yet I want, we've got to film our mistakes too what mistakes <laughs> there's that, not been any mistakes yet. you're about to make a big mess <laughs> <laughs> all right so see if we can fucking get it here Come on, dude. Flex, those, <sighs> flex your arms. Oh my god, shut up. <laughs> so, you, what you want to do is get it really almost all the way out, and then if you're a good mechanic, you'll be able to spin it with your fingers and not get any oil on yourself. That's not the case. Keep going. Yeah, get it, get it where it's about to come out, and then if you spin the shit out of it, oh, you're about to get wet. How long is this shit? It's about to splash everywhere. That's done, okay. One, two, three. Oh, <laughs> no, not that. Like, you do it with one finger. No, you do it fast. What are you doing? Shut up. <laughs> that wasn't so bad. All right, so. Going. Got our little bolt right here. Does it have a washer on there? No. No? No. That's surprising. Glug, 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 glug. Look at the base of the nut and make sure it doesn't have a washer on it. Yeah, there's, not, there's nothing in here. I feel like Look. there really should be one. You see Dude, it? this thing focuses really well. Yeah, it's got that, that real good focus, full focus. All right, so now that while that drains, we're just going to let it drain. <laughs> you can tell it's draining because of the way it is. The way it is. The way it drains. Insert clip here. <laughs> Next, we're gonna take the filter out. Or should we just wait till it's done? Wait till it's done. Recording now. All right, so next, well that's draining the last little bit, we're gonna use this handy dandy shit that I've never used. 
to take the filter out. So I guess you just wrap it around there. How do you use this thing? Squeeze it, squeeze it. Squeeze and turn, turn. turn I'm turn, turning. Turn. turn, turn, turn. I'm turning, dude. Open it up, dude. That's open, dude. What are you? Oh, okay. Well, do the thing. What the fucking thing? Grab dude? it, grab it. Yeah, squeeze it. Squeeze that joker. Squeeze it and then turn while you squeeze. Do you need a real man? Yeah, dude, I need Dude, flex your arms, dude. I need your little arms in here, dude. Watch out, watch out. Dude. Can Greg come on the other side? No, dude, I'm right here. Oh, there you go. Where's the thing? There it is. Where's the fucking oil filter at? Oh, there it is. I'm gonna just loosen it for you. Yeah, yeah. Actually, move. Ready? Yeah, it's recording. So it's this way, right? Yeah. It's no, the other way. This way? Yeah. There you go. All right, so, oh my God, this is gonna make a fucking mess. I can already feel it. This big ass thing. Oh, oh my God, she's a leaky son of a bitch. Oh, fuck! I told you, dude. <laughs> we'll let it. We'll let her leak out a little bit. You come here often, dude? Yeah. Give me one of those rags. I got it. No, don't do it. I can't clean my own arm. <laughs> don't hit my arm because I'm barely holding the camera. Hit your arm? Don't. She's a coming. Come a flowing, come a flowing. But I want to take the whole fucking thing off already. I'm fucking tired of this shit. I'm tired of this You have a glove on. Just use your glove. Don't do that. Oh my gosh. Josh, you're making a big mess. <laughs> God damn it. This was a horrible idea. It's nice and warm, though. Yeah, dude. I knew a girl like that. Oh, my God. I need, your, I need this. your arms, dude. I needed this for the grip, dude. It's like grip no, tape. dude. It's like grip tape, dude. Dude, you just ruined that rag, dude. It's a good thing that it was like five bucks for a pack of like a bunch of them. You know at shops they'll get rags like that and they just they send them to get washed. Go, 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 go. Dude, yeah. That's how I started drinking that beer last night. Oh my god. Go, go, go! <laughs> oh, oh shit. I told you specifically not to do that. <laughs> All right. So now that that's off, looks like any other oil change job, what you want to do is you want to check the filter to make sure that the O-ring that it has on there didn't get stuck on, that it still has it there. This one, you can see, it still has it there. So that means that it did not get stuck. Yeah, sometimes sometimes the O-ring will stick to stuck. the oil filter housing. Yep. And then you'll put a new oil filter on there and it'll be double O-ring, so it'll it'll like immediately leak out most of the oil yep. from the truck as soon as you try it. And now on. what you want to do is you want to just put this on here. Oh cool, it's magnetic. Yeah, dude. Is there any particles on there? No, there's no particles. You got, it. got a good motor, dude. Got a good 7.3, baby. And then you just want to go ahead and close this up. What the fuck is that? Close this up. Make and sure, then, make sure that when you do this, that you cross thread it. Yeah, make sure <laughs> you do that. And put Loctite. Yeah, yeah, you definitely the Loctite's a must. The cross threading's all right, but Loctite's what you want. That's a joke, obviously. Don't do that. <laughs> somebody's gonna watch this video one day and be like, "You fucking fucked up my truck." I can't get my drain plug off. <laughs> Then you just want to tighten this up. You don't need to go too hard. I go hard all the time. He is notorious for all aspects for of life. Going hard. Clean off the excess oil here. Like DJ Cali said, go hard. Tighten it. Yeah, go, just go, go. a little bit overhand tight. Nothing oh, yeah. too crazy. And dry her off. Oh yeah, she was wet, wet. So she's good. All right. Where's that cut? Filter at? Weird angle, but weird angle. But what you want to do, or what I always do. Just go ahead and don't spill it. Put the oil in the filter. So she's got brand new oil already. 
Nice and Don't all. put too much either. All the way to the top? Oh, no. <laughs> so why not? Just because you're going to have to tilt it a little bit. You don't want to spill any under here. All right, and then what you're going to do is you can take some of the old oil or the new oil and just put it on the O-ring. So I'll probably use some of the old oil, to be honest. Oh, fuck. Damn, she takes a lot of I keep putting, and it keeps going down. Are you sure that's the right filter? Yeah. This is the one that we looked in the book. So, lube it up. It's taking almost a whole gallon. You mean a whole quart? Dude, look at that leak. leak. It's coming down the side, dude. Hurry. Get it. Oh, yeah, there you go. So, filter is almost filled up to the top. The O ring is on there pretty good. Oh my god, I didn't think this. Yeah, now you gotta crawl under here with it. <laughs> and it's it still, it's still, it still can hold more, dude. No, dude. No, Josh, no. Stop. You're gonna make a mess. It's, well, it must be done, dude. Josh. It's still going down. All right, so. We are back under the truck, under the F-350. Come on, do the inchworm. Flex your arms, dude. Shut up. Okay. So we're here. God damn. All right, so get under here. And then you're gonna find the hole. Sometimes that can be hard. Depending on who is doing it, and then. And then sometimes it's like. Is it? Why am I going the yeah, right way? Yeah, keep going, keep going that way. This way? Yep. Alright, and then just like that. You get it on there. And what, the way you want to tighten this down is you want to just get it hand tight. And I'm using the rag so I can get more grip. Traction control. Grip tape. Clean this off. Clean it off a little bit more. Put the rag here. Let's go ahead and again hand tight. Yeah, right there. And then you want to wipe off any oil that might have fell off while you were doing the oil change. So that way when you come back later, you're not freaking out like, why the fuck is there so much oil everywhere? And then you remember, oh, that was when I changed the oil because I'm an idiot. So there you go. And then that's it. Now we're going to go fire the truck up. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> now we got to add the rest of the oil. Put the oil first, boys. <laughs> yeah, so go ahead, cut. Yeah, I am. No, I saw the light wasn't on. It's on. No, it the light's on, Josh. There's a light on the front. It says record hey. our wreck. So, now we're going to add the oil right in here. Oh, yeah. I can get her in there. Oh, fill her up, Josh. 15 quarts, all right? 15 quarts. For those of you that don't know, like me, that's 3.75 gallons. It's a quarter past three gallons. <laughs> Why don't you just say <laughs> it's 3.75? What's a... <laughs> Hey, <laughs> it's a it's a it's a quarter till four. Why don't you just say it's three seventy five, dude? You always piss me off too. Hey, while while we got this badass truck in the background, y'all make sure y'all go ahead, y'all go ahead. First off, drop a thumbs up below, and then follow this guy right here, Fly FX Four on Instagram. Also, Sean O'Connor on YouTube. Yep, shameless plug. <laughs> and then we got more oil. Get oh, that oh, oh, dude, oh, pour oh. it from the side, dude. What are you doing? What do you mean the turn side? Turn it. Turn it sideways. Turn it. Kill no, shot. The bottle, dude. The what? bottle. <laughs> what the, bottle? The bottle. The only <laughs> bottle in your hand. Turn it. No, on the side. On the. There. <laughs> See how much better it pours. God, I God. mean, yeah, but that's not necessary. We're not. It's not a race. The turtle, no, but it dude. comes out more smooth. It doesn't matter. Hey, oh my God. <laughs> right there. Dude, let it, you all that wasted oil, dude. Yeah, it's probably dude, so. you leave that much oil in that bottle, and the United States is going to invade that bottle. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking stupid. <laughs>
here sideways. What are you doing? This is a nice camera, dude. Yeah. I got it with the oil money, with my doge. The oil money, dude. We working in the oil fields. Uh, wait up. About to do a, a doge check. A doge check. Let's check it out. What's the live ticker? You pull it up. You pull it up, and there's like Pornhub and stuff open. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right, let's get the Doge. The Doge check. Get in there. Oh, that's not looking good. Sixty-three. Hurry up if you want to buy. Now's the time. Oh, look at that graph, dude. What did it go up to today earlier? The highest it was in the last twenty-four hours oh, was seventy. Seventy-one, and it's down at sixty-three. Seventy-four. Seventy-four, dude. Yep. I think if you've got like ten thousand or more dollars in this that's a yeah, big that's, difference yep not me i got honest money in there all right so last two gallons here well remember oh yeah quarter past yeah that one only is 0.75 dude it is freezing out here dude it's like let's check the temperature check baby temperature check you can cut the recording, dude. No, this is good. This is good. It is freezing out here, dude. Look. <laughs> 70 degrees is not freezing. <laughs> I am freezing out here, dude. Uh, Look at this. This is not a racetrack, young man. Young man, this is not a racetrack. Slow it down. Slow it down, buddy. <laughs> I put the camera on the neighbor. He was like looking like, what the hell? <laughs> Hope he comes back here so I can beat him up. You can't beat anybody. Well, yeah, he was a big dude, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I hope right. he comes back here to beat me up. <laughs> <laughs> he comes back here to beat you up. Yeah. All right. So now we're going to put the quarter past part in here. Dude, it is freezing, dude. Dude, there's a bunch of new roofs in this neighborhood. The hurricane. Like your neighbor that across the street, that's a new roof. That one's not. I have a new roof. That's a new roof. Yeah, this is a new roof. All right, so the last one, you're going to leave 0.15, right? Or or what? You're going to leave 1.0. Oh, uh, 1.0. Close, close enough. Actually, hold on. See which one's quartz. Uh, quartz is right here. Yeah, you're going to leave 1.0 on that one. All right. Leaders, what is this? Top gear? No, because top gear is trash now. Without, without the original Without the people. funny people? Yeah. All right. Uh, sideways four. Oh shit, Kobe. Turn it, turn it, turn it. Oh my god, Josh. This thing's cool. It's got like a little microphone little thing. Like when you're real loud, it'll show you that you're loud. Oh shit, right on the money, dude. I think let's get, let's get level right here. Get low, get low. That, that thing level. is not level. <laughs> no, you got a little bit more. Just hold it. I can see when it's level. Yes. Yeah, I mean, we could check the dipstick. That's what the dipstick. Yeah, is that's for. really what we should do. Yeah. <laughs> well, you gotta put all the caps, the cap on, and fire. Crank this thing up. Hey, when you get crank it up, let me hear this thing. Can I get a hell yeah? Hell yeah, brother. Can I get a hell yeah? Dude, that tip makes me feel like a small man. Shoes! Shoes! Alright, here we go. Let's see if we blew it up. You put the cap? What? You put the cap on? Yep, cold start for the boys. brother yep no leaks hey y'all want to hear what a real truck sounds like though we'll get that we'll get him going off later <laughs> the jet has landed now we're checking the oil the dipstick the oil dipstick to make sure I didn't just blow up the motor by revving it with no oil. God damn, that's a big ass dipstick. 
Dude, that ain't the first time I heard that, boy. They call it the dipstick for you. That, you know, these country girls. Shove her in there. Josh, we gotta wrap it up, dude. It is getting cold out here. I, I Dude, I ain't even BSing, dude. It's the breeze. Because we're right here by the water. I got beachfront property. Yeah, beachfront, dude. Right here. Right here's the beach. You look. Can't really see anything. <laughs> yeah, it's not focusing. Well, that's not good if you can't see anything. No, you're right there. You're good. So I need uh, to add a little bit more? Oh. Uh, did you put it all the way down? Yeah. Yeah, you might have to add some. So... We're gonna dip, dip it in there one more time. Dip in the pen and the company ink. I like when I film because my personality could really just come out. When I'm recording myself, I yeah. get all So serious. you can see right there, it says we're right at the bottom. It says it has ADD, which is attention deficit disorder. Um, so you I need have. to add another uh, Another court. Dang, brother, this thing sounds good. See, I get distracted. All right, so now what we're gonna do is we're obviously gonna add that a little bit more. More power bubble. Begging for more, begging for more. More power bubble. More power bubble. You've seen it, we accidentally blew the motor up. Yeah, now we're gonna do a six, seven swap. <laughs> no, everything went good. Uh, the maintenance is done for at least another 5,000 miles. The fuel fuel filter and the freaking oil change is all good. So, big thanks to Sean. His channel will be linked down below. Uh, two dudes and a 69 at yahoo.com is his email. And that's also his channel name. Now, his channel name is Sean with like an H or some shit. I don't know who spells it. Just like that. We'll just drop <laughs> yeah, I'll put the link down below. <laughs> but big thanks to him. Uh, but yeah, see you guys next time. Subscribe. Hey y'all, remember to comment, like, and subscribe. Rez out.